Lola. Hope that you are doing exceptionally pleasant this evening. And welcome to our very sleepy and very relaxing ASMR video. And it's going to be an exceptionally delicate, hopefully, and sleepy unboxing. And the main thing with ASMR is, of course, microphones uh, to do so. So with me, which I use, uh, the microphones which I've been using, uh, usually is the Blue Spark microphones and their condenser microphones as well. Uh, and they're good, but they keep having a little bit of um, minds of their own and want to do things by themselves. So I thought, well, let's expand our microphone collection and unbox another set of microphones which will be exceptionally useful I'm sure for smart purposes and then we'll compare both of them and that will hopefully give you tickles with the comparison things. So I'll try and put um, timestamps below of all the points uh, which we do so like the unboxing and the actual thing so you, if you want you can go straight to that and just get your tingles. Um, but hopefully that the whole thing and unboxing and all the sounds that it's going to make and really nice things are going to make you feel nice and smart and tingled and relaxed because that's what I'm here to do for you. To make you feel relaxed, to make you feel good and uh, to ASMR throughout the whole thing. And I think for me, like I said in many videos, it's the intricate little sounds and in things which give me the crazy uh, ASMR tingles. So, unboxing videos, I watch a lot of unboxing videos and I'm a bit of a junkie for that and um, just really enjoy those sounds. And it's always an added bonus if it's done in an ASMR style because you are seeking those perfect sounds which I want to pass on to you and your brain to pass on wherever you need it to go. Yes. Okay then. The microphones in question today are oh, please be the right away. same effect which I have uh, with my videos now so it'd be very interesting to see uh, how it 
um, shapes up to these because these ones which I use now are I think they were made in 2018 so you would assume the technology would have been a little bit more superior to the NT ones um, but if you look at the NT ones I think they were created um, by Rode Australia company um, in 2016 I think these were or 2013 um, it could be before um, but they've been out for quite some time but for the tingle effect uh, they are quite popular for the tingly sound so I thought to, to give my voice an added extra dimension that this would be a set of microphones that would ting you more and to give us more variety with our ASMR videos so I don't think we need two of them up here at the moment but we'll just rub it and then we'll get to the unboxing and picking out every little sound we can every little meticulous little bit that we can get from this box okay. circular ones uh, but this one is a metallic one it looks more professional and would hopefully stop that that you would hear when someone's talking and now this is going to be in a shock mount uh, kind of different to the shock mounts which I have in my current microphones and then this attachment attaches to your microphone stands which I have abundance in abundance so we have this guy here and I think I think he's a vlogger but I could be wrong but he's a vlogger or a, a singer maybe could be a singer uh, or he could be an ASMR artist uh, but I think now when these microphones uh, these sorts of microphones I'm pretty sure that the creators are like maybe Rode might be aware that their microphones are extremely beneficial for ASMR artists people who like listening to ASMR and people like you who want tingles and uh, they design microphones I'd like to think they design it with the idea of using sounds in mind and it's not just like a generic uh, yeah this is for your ASMR artist generic thing it's like for for musicians and things and also using the latest uh, technology to take into consideration sounds that you'll be creating that's what i'd like to think but i think ASMR was not as blown up as it is now uh, when these were first created but these uh, are a thicker microphone a light design of the color scheme here the black microphones and the white background and i don't know what it is but road always looks like you get uh, your money's worth just because it looks professional um, these microphones which I got they're just in the similar packaging if you remember the previous uh, unboxing that we did for that but 
and they weren't as big looking, they wasn't as professional looking. And with these microphones, I had to send, I think I had uh, three more sent to me, and I had to take three back because each of them suffered from a hissing problem, so low noise, shh, why did I guess that, I don't know, um, bad stick, uh, but on low noise, or the white noise you would hear now, it should basically be nothing, but with the other microphones which I had at these, one of them was just ridiculously loud, and it was just, I had a period I thought, my goodness, what's going on, I think this was like a year ago, and I kept having to send them back, and then they sent another one, like, why are you sending me off stock, basically, uh, but Rose, you don't look like you have that problem, I would at least hope that we don't anyway, we will soon see, so we have what's included in it, we have a microphone dust cover, so if you want to really look after your microphones. And then we have the detached pop shield. That's the one. <laughs> Trying to read it upside down. And then the shot mount and then the microphone. All information. Nicely presented here. So the microphone shield here. The pop shield there. The shock mount there. And the microphone. The different, uh, I think, different modes that you can use this, or the design of it, or all the things that comes with it. Rather, ten years warranty. So I don't think these microphones would have that which I'm using, but that's good because you know that they're going to last. Uh, accessories included: is it shock, shock mount and things. Um, integrated Rycote Lyre shock mounting system. Sounds very high tech and professional and all new capsule and electronics. So this one seems extremely positive right now. Then on the sides we have some nice artwork and the road logo. If things are designed and presented well, just just randomly will track me. Like this road is a really pleasant design. Just little tiny bits like here yeah, on this road. That's the point. And I'll ask you just to look as I point at them. R O D E. Gold logo. Don't know what it says. I predict road.com. But I could be wrong. Just little things like that I find. Yes. I'm very impressed with 
nice looks to begin with. Uh, I'm kind of very excited as well. The microphone has got a really nice grill mount around it as well. I don't know what you would call that really. Um, but it looks 10 times better, a lot more durable and, and hard wearing as opposed to the blue sparks which I have. Um, this cardboard condenser microphone is in a very nice matte black. I like all my equipment to be black and matte black. I think it's very smart. Uh, color for, for stuff that you're working with. It's like sleepy almost, uh, but it looks really good. And it's wrapped up in this plastic here. Uh, of course, keep it dust free, etc. Okay. But uh, yeah, it looks really good. 
there's nothing like interesting just shows you like the setup that if you seem to struggle putting it together okay and now i'm not sure what this is but i guess it's out anyway so it has a blue thing in there
smart indeed. Uh, so inside it has that smell of a new car which you don't expect that a microphone would do but it's got it it's got it anyway and I love the smell the new car smell so yeah that's quite impressive okay so this right is protected in just a kind of simple cardboard thing nothing to Now that looks 
looks like you're doing 10 knots better job and it's got a plastic bit at the end which you've got to be careful with but this around the grill is metallic and it doesn't even pick up the sound that much I don't think so it's already doing its job slots on and I say simply and I say slots on but it might not I want to make sure I got this the right way ok so that should, there we go slides on the top there and then yeah so that looks very professional looking I'd say and uh, I'm very much looking forward to using these and testing these, which we're about to do compared to the ones that I got now and I think just the look of them by themselves are uh, a lot more ASMR than the ones that I've currently got but we'll just have a little test and see so that's the Rode NT1 microphone so like I said it's uh, very nice, very relaxing and sounds good and hopefully the ting wasn't bad to do um, ting you is more you even more but all little bits we've got here i really like road and as a company as well um i think the things they come up with have been extremely beneficial for me and uh, even on my other channel night adventures with the with the mic boots that i use on my camera there to take out and about uh, exceptionally good and with the wind filters but also they've come out with a new one as well where you clip on and it's wireless and that looks and sounds really good as well so that's great for GoPros and what have you so I, I like the fact that they're starting to switch it up a little bit and create more interesting things because I feel like there was a little bit of a time period uh, where they're probably just designing more things they've got a good microphones out already but now it's new and newer things so uh, I think Rhodes is going to really knock it out the box These are my normal microphones, but the ones which I've been having a little bit of problems with recently. Uh, and now these ones, hello there, hello there. And we've just blessed them with our first hello there, and um, I know that they think that we're a bold one, but yeah. So, hello, hello there, this is the road, road microphone. And now hello there, hello there, this is the blue spark of microphone. Now when I was trying to look for the, the first microphones, the Rode ones did uh, initially stand out to me at first, but instead of getting these ones first, um, I thought I would get something which I thought would be more suited for my voice because I think these uh, resonate better with deeper voices. These ones here, the outside ones, my old ones. And these ones are better uh, with the sounds, but probably not so good with my voice because I've a bit of a sort of bassy feel to it. And I think the older my voice pick it up. But we're going to put it to the test and just roll with some sound. So we'll start with the spark ones first. Oh, 
Microphones is the way to go for the setup for ASMR tingles. I don't know, but let me know. I bet it's pretty cool. So I hope that you found your tingles pretty cool. 